Welcome to Mountain TV. I'm meteorologist Cassie Clavin. Before we jump into an active forecast, I have this picture of this funnel cloud that was sent in on Wednesday. This picture taken in just uh, taken uh, just after 2 p.m. where we did see this small funnel cloud out there. It was broken up quickly by the mountains uh, and there's no reports of any damage or injuries, but what a beautiful picture. Thanks so much for sending this in of that small funnel cloud that we saw on Wednesday. Now, as we head into the day today and the weekend, we are expecting to see some active weather, few storms today, severe storms possible, mainly today from 3 to 7 p.m. So that's when we're want, going to want to be very weather aware biggest concerns with this are going to be the potential to see some damaging wind. We're talking 65 mile per hour wind gusts and then uh, going to be seeing some hail with this, some of these storms as well. So we'll be paying close attention to that. Here's what we're looking at for our severe weather threat for the most part. Most of us under just this general risk, but as you head further out east, that's where we get up to this slight risk. So further out east has the better potential to see that severe weather, but still we'll just want to be paying close attention uh, to this forecast. That's also where we're going to see some of the heavier of the rain showers. Denver looking at staying under a tenth of an inch, and as you head further out west, things looking to stay dry, not only today, but as we head into the weekend. So let's take a look at what's going on starting first thing this morning. We'll start to see some of those showers and thunderstorms develop later on this afternoon into the evening. For the most part, fairly isolated with that severe weather between about 3 and 7 p.m. tonight, staying mainly east. Then as we head into tomorrow, a few more isolated showers and thunderstorms going to be possible. So we'll keep those in the forecast once again, looking at staying mainly east for that severe weather. So here's what we're looking at for temperatures to go along with it. Denver today at 89 degrees, otherwise a fruit ahead today at 94 degrees. A lot of sunshine as you're not seeing those showers and thunderstorms. So you should be able to get out and enjoy. Then temperatures will be cooling off. Denver going to be cooling down into the 70s by the day Sunday. Some more active weather is expected Sunday into Monday, so we'll be keeping an eye on that. Winter Park staying right about 70 as we head into the next few days. Vail, plenty of sunshine staying in the mid 70s. Overall, a nice forecast. Overnight lows dropping down into the 40s. Copper Mountain staying in the 60s. A lot of sunshine for the next several days. That's it for your mountain weather. Up next, mountain traffic.